Would you like to share a little background and share your journey to becoming a Zen eating guide? Of course. So I am sharing how to eat now, which is like conscious eating. But to come to here, I had like long journey. I have been meditating for 10 years based on Zen, Zazen meditation and other many types of meditation. And I was born in the countryside of Japan with mountain, like North countryside of Japan. And my grandparents have a mountain and uh, surrounded by wild vegetables, wild plants. And they, without knowing, they have this connectedness. They have this connected life. I grew up in Tokyo, so I was always admiring them, like, how beautiful their life is but i'm having this urban life which i like so i decided to work for a wellness department at luxury resort hotel in japan and i was happy that i was able to have wellness moment with my clients guests at that resort but at the same time i was working too much mm -hmm. overworking and I burned out. I had to quit my job because of my health condition. And that was challenging for me. I was working for wellness, but my own wellness, I, I didn't have time to take care of my own wellness. And I, I moved to India and decided to live mm -hmm. in India for one and a half year to two years. And I learned Indian traditional medicine, which called Ayurveda and Indian nutrition, uh, how to make balanced diet for your body, according to your body condition, your body type, which was fascinating. And the reason that I started learning about this nutrition was my mother overcame from the chronic illness, which is called rheumatoid arthritis. Mm -hmm by changing her diet to healthier vegetable oriented or like less artificial things sure and so i i realized wow what to eat and health is so strongly related so i thought that nutrition is something really important for me and for everyone so uh that's why i was i went into nutrition and diet healthy diet but I realized that as I became more healthy diet uh, geek, mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I, I realized like I, I was far from happy state because I was so judgmental. Like I cannot eat this and you should not eat this. And at that point, I realized that how to eat or mindset while eating is as, as important as what you eat. So... I came back to this meditational approach, which I started when I lost my father by helicopter accident at the age of 14. I was 14 years old. So I met Zen and Zen helped me so much. So I integrated Zen and this eating. And I started sharing how to do it, how to practice it with people, with companies. So that's how I started Zen eating. 